Today we're going to be learning how to create master pages in InDesign. This is something that I didn't know how to do right away when I first started using InDesign, but it saves a lot of time when you're using InDesign to create a multiple page document or publication. So first I'm going to show you an example of something that I created in, in InDesign using master pages. Then I'm going to go through step by step how to use it yourself and how to apply those master pages to your document. This is a magazine project that I created using InDesign. You can see the similar design across the pages which I accomplished using master pages. The horizontal bars at the top and the bottom of the pages, as well as the logo in the top right corner were all done using master pages. I added the text to the bars separately so I could vary it for each page, but you can also add them to the master pages and have it applied to all pages. And we're gonna create a new document under file, and we're gonna create a simple four page document with facing pages, leaving the rest at default to keep it simple. And then it's gonna come up with a front cover page, two interfacing pages, as well as a back page. Now we're going to create a master page that will apply to the front cover and the back and the in two interfacings, but not the back cover page. To edit a master page, you first want to go to the Pages panel over here on the right side of the screen. Once you open the panel, you see this here that's called A Master with the two facing page icons. You can edit these and easily apply them to any of the pages you are working on within your document. Double click on the page icon by A Master, so you've now selected the A master pages to edit, meaning any changes made right now will automatically be applied to all pages in your document that use this master page, which by default is all of them. The right side page affects the right side pages in your document, while the left side page affects the left side pages in your document. It's pretty simple. Now we're, we'll create our design by going to our rectangle tool here and drawing a rectangle tool across the top of the left side of the page. We'll go over to color and we'll fill it with some nice color there. And then we'll use our black arrow tool and click on that and then press Command C or Control C on our PC. So we can easily repeat that and apply it to the other parts of the page. And just kind of mirror it down there so it's the same. And then we'll go over and do it on the same on the right side of the page. Now we go back into our pages panel and you'll see on your A master that they, the icons now have the bars that we just designed. You can also see that they've already been applied to your document. Now, because the back page doesn't have that, we, that is because we go to Apply Master to Pages and you'll see in this dialog box that appears that the Apply Master is set to none. See, that wasn't so hard, was it? Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please share it if you did. Have a great day.